Hi everyone, welcome to day 50 of year 2 of Awesome. So today I'm going to be talking to you guys about the new Panic at the Disco album, uh, Vice and Virtues. Now this was actually a really, really nice surprise because it's a really, really good album. Uh, it it's definitely shows the, the biggest reason why the second album wasn't such a big success, at least for me, was because of all the argumentation going on because of artistic differences. So now that the argumentation is gone, when the two members left and they were replaced, the, the music is back to what it was in the first uh, Fever You Can't Sweat Out album. And so it's actually really, really cool because it's just back to being super duper awesome. Now, don't get me wrong, Pretty Odd was a, was a, was a decent album. I'm, I'm not going to say it was as good as Fever You Can't Sweat Out because it wasn't. Fever You Can't Sweat Out was definitely a really just fantastic, awesome album. Uh, uh, Vice and Virtue is definitely going to be up there in that level of just sheer amazing awesomeness. The songs that I would recommend for anyone who maybe doesn't necessarily want to buy the album, but does want to listen to the music, would include uh, The Ballad of Mona Lisa. That's, that's a really good song. It's also the, the hit single that came from the album that they released. And it's just thoroughly enjoyable. I have it on repeat constantly, just because it's it's really nice. Uh, they have this this just pure sound that is unparalleled anywhere. Well, I I don't want to say unparalleled anywhere. Pretty damn close to unparalleled anywhere. I recommend listening to Hurricane, Memories, Nearly Witches. Uh, these are all just really really cool. Like Nearly Witches has this also almost salsa feel while Hurricane is just very energetic and then it also has like a little uh, epilogue to the song which is really nice uh, that leads into the next song so that's kind of cool. It's really all I wanted to talk about today because it's just it's just a good album. Uh, it, it really shows that the one artistic vision is showing through and showing through just incredibly well. So uh, today I also released uh, a new analysis video on Mr. Well Actually, so I'll go ahead and link his video, the, the video right, right here, and I'll go ahead and catch you guys tomorrow. Bye.